Welcome back to our Two Minute Tuesdays with Trish and Pastor Dave. <laughs> two minute, two, two, two. All right, well, we're in a different location, obviously. We are. <laughs> it's not Look, ideal, but here we are. Loving our COVID safe yeah. for the moment because exactly. it's spiking so high. Yeah, so we're kind of just out in our normal, not in our normal. Lots of air <laughs> away from other people. That yes. Kind of thing. <laughs> All right, so today's question If God loves us so much, why doesn't He just save everyone? Interesting. I think we've kind of addressed this before, but so nice we can ask it twice. It's fine. Sure. So technically we don't know that God doesn't. And this is what we say, that it's really God's decision whom God saves. Neither you nor I nor anyone else can uh, control or predict that. Sure. So God might save everyone. God might save no one. It might be somewhere in between. It's not our job to judge that. But what do we do? Our job is to love people and care about people as God loves them, or as if they were quote unquote saved or whatever good category we want to put on it. Mm -hmm. And the reason for that is simple, because if God does love and or save someone and we treat them horribly, God's going to be cranky. If God doesn't love someone or someone is excluded, but we still love them, we're still doing what we're supposed to do, no matter what they do and no matter what God's opinion is of it. So we are doing what we're supposed to do either way. Okay. One way you can't win, the other way you can't lose. So it's best, even if we don't know, to treat everyone as if they were inside the loved, wonderful, saved group, and then we don't have to worry. All right. Well, if you have your own questions, we have a forum at lightofthespirit.church and his Twitter. At Dave Deckard. And an email. Pastor at sov-id.org. Yeah, we'd love to see your questions. All right, we'll see you next week for our next video.